So today for the Oriental Dance Basics, I'm explaining the hip drop. Oh, let me put a belt. So for the hip drop, you need to have the right alignment and position as I have already been explaining in the modules before, in the lessons before. For the hip drop, you want to feel like if you have a very big hip and, and throw the hip to the side. When you do this, throwing it to the side, you need your knees as always to be bent. And if you imagine you have a big, big, big hip and like, boom, boom. When you see my hip thrown to the side and it is loose and it will automatically uh, do a little like, blah, 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 blah. yeah, hop, hop. So if you want to see if you are doing it right, when you are launching the hip and you're throwing the hip to the side, it, the energy goes here, not here, not here. So not doing it, doing it right will look like this. Not right will look like this. When you are controlling the movement, you will have something like this, probably also the shoulders moving. Yes, so you, and, and, and you could also do it like this, then it is work. No, you just want to feel that go of the hip and like throw it. Feel like a big mama, something with your big, 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 and then a boom and boom. Yeah, this is what you want to do. If you want to see if it works, you go to a door and you open the door here with this spot just um, there. And then boom, yeah, one, two, three, four, hop, 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 hop. Yes, this is the energy. It's a strong energy. It can open or close the door. So this is the basic of the hip being loose. Now we want to do a hip drop. You get on one foot. Let me show you my back. Left foot. You put all your weight on the left side. And here you go up and let go. Up, let go. Up. Let go. It's like a drop, but it is not like me dropping and pushing. It's up and I let go. Up, let go. Other side, up, let go. Up, let go. Up, let go. What is the most important here is that your knees, both knees, are bent. If you don't, then you have this. If you watch yourself in the mirror and see you are doing this, I guarantee you that this leg, this knee is not bent. You need it to be bent to be free. Hop and hop and hop and hop and hop and hop. This is a simple hip drop. So you can walk with this where you do one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, up, change the feet, drop, 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 up, change the feet, drop, 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 up, change, drop, 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 and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, four, going back, now front, just kick, kick or let the hip sway one side, one side, one side. First, before you can start walking, you normally would need to have this right. Try and train it with the door, as I said. And the, then you walk. When you walk front, you don't want to walk like an elephant. Close your feet one foot behind uh, in front of the other. So not like this, but here. And when you drop, same thing. Close the space which is here. Don't do it like this. This is not oriental. Oriental is always here and you always close the space. Very feminine. Okay, I hope you enjoy this movement. And here you are. <laughs> Let me know if it is difficult or not, complicated or not, and I can help you if you need it. Ciao, ciao.